If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and turn on post notifications because all the teen news drama is always uploaded here first. In this video, we're going to be going over on how Berwadis basically breaks down on social media and reveals the truth about Jackie Figueroa. Now to start off, we all know that he recently moved out of his parents' house and he also has been looking for a girlfriend recently. He did a YouTube video on this and misunderstood that these girls were in fact twins and he also goes on by Twitter by saying RIP Berwadis. Now the tweet that he was in fact replying was the week and Rosalia and if you guys don't know already Rosalia is one of his celebrity crushes so he has been lonely and he has opened up about this on social media although yesterday things didn't go good as planned he took this on his Instagram story by making multiple posts and it goes on by saying another day Now this is at his parents house and he goes on by saying I'm human too, I'm no different than any of you guys. Now he basically follows up by saying that we all have different types of levels of stress and continues on by saying that he's not feeling his best. After posting this, he continued on by saying what makes me happy is that basically the basketball gyms are in fact closed due to this whole situation going on. But we all know how truly he is and he isn't really a negative person or hasn't even posted anything negative on social media but this is one of the first times that he has opened up. But he clarifies this by just saying that he apologizes for kind of just posting negative stuff on social media and clarifies also by saying just not there mentally. This is the first time that he has really just opened up but he goes on by just saying that he's not happy and you can also see this on his recent YouTube videos as well. With that being said, this was his final Instagram post or story that he did made and it was with Booker. Anyways, if you guys don't follow him on Twitter, he does actually open up as well by saying your happiness should always be the priority number one. So he went from living in an apartment to his parents to then owning his own house and now back to his parents and he clearly opens up that the two people that were in his life now have moved out. Now what he means by this is that the two people who were the closest to him aren't really in his life anymore and this has to do with Jackie and and Dennis but he also opens up on social media by going to Twitter and actually going towards Jackie Figueroa I mean he deleted these tweets afterwards but these are some screenshots in which we found now in fact within these past few days she has opened up by saying that she has an NDA and that she's not going to be saying anything regarding this whole relationship now an NDA is a non-disclosure agreement and he also goes on by saying just so everyone knows she also made me sign an NDA so to sum this up in simple terms basically it's a contract in which anything in which they've done to each other they can't really open up on social media or tell anybody else you can see right here he goes on by making this tweet and people did in fact respond and he did reply to this one person in which he says no now what that person said was to get back to you know who and here's how his day went yesterday as he wasn't feeling the best the king of the dome of flip watch me the trick flip one two three one two three so we can do this it's hot Wow. 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 <laughs> Dude, okay. Noah, like something needs to be done. Like, come on, bro. Please. Call the barber, help him. Please, help. please. Help. Help. Dump that. No. I ate all day. Nobody's gonna know. Okay, let's leave this. Stop. Oh. So it's ready. I'll tell you that much. Bro, I love. Dude, I I eat almost every day. I try to eat every day. Bro, no, I I devour. I'm one of the best. Dude, I love. Ever. Anyways, that's how his day went yesterday, but apart from that, Jackie has been doing her own pathway and just been doing her own things recently. Now you can see right here on what she decided to post on social media and she said tomorrow's video and as you can see, it's a pregnancy stick that says pregnant. Although she makes it very clear after that she isn't in fact pregnant and she goes on by making this caption on her story. Also, Brandon did in fact shade Jackie Figueroa when he moved back into his parents' house by showing off Jackie Figueroa's clothes. She wasn't happy at all and goes on by saying those clothes aren't mine. I'm tired of the videos made to as if he doesn't know why I left. With that being said, she also made a comment on all of this and here is what she put on Instagram.
Anyways, I will be showing you guys responses regarding this whole situation of how Berwadis is doing and here's some responses to what people think. Anyways, as you can see right there, let me know what you guys think about this whole situation and what does he need to be happy again. Although I will be showing you guys a live stream video in which he did with Anthony and Noor, but let me know what you guys think about this situation and what you think about him bringing up Jackie. Tomorrow, bro. Tomorrow? Yeah. Already? <laughs> hey, I'm a loyal customer. Dude, it's been like, three, I know, but it's been three, like two days. Bro. No, bro, for real, look. Hold on, guys. Ooh. Oh, wow. I mean, now they got closer. Wait, I just need to see if I have a okay, so we have about 20K people in here. Perfect for Noor. Where did she go? I think she got scared. She went back. <laughs> yeah. Let me get Noor, everybody's favorite. Noor. Where are you going? Are you ready? Hey, imagine all the video recordings. Hey, Booker. Oh, no. Oh, no. What did he do? Oh, no. Where are you going? Okay, well, he wants to come too. Okay, Nora. So, are we still with the agreement? Because we got to say it on live. For what? Okay, guys. So, I challenge Nora to... Uh, Yes, we can't do a one on one because I'll literally crush her. Keep in mind, I'm her. five two and I have no arm strength. Didn't you play eighteen basketball in middle school, sixth grade? Okay. <laughs> Anyways, so I'm challenging Nor to a shooting contest. Hey, and I lied; it was actually B team. Okay, B team. <laughs> if I beat Nor, then Nor, you have to give me five bucks. But if you beat me, I'll give you a hundred. Why not ten k? Okay. okay, you want ten k? No, no. 100, yeah, that's fine. 100, 100. No, oh, yeah, because you're really gonna beat me. Okay, so if Noor beats me, I give her 10K. No three-pointers. Yeah, three-pointers. Okay, let me try one three-pointer. Okay, and if I win, then she gives me $5. I'm not doing three-pointers. Wait, 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 why? And if you guys made it this far of the video, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and turn on post notifications because all the teen news drama is always uploaded here first, and hopefully enjoy the video.